ओके हेलो टेकीज वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल एंड आई पोस्ट आई टी रिलेटेड एंड टेक्नोलॉजी रिलेटेड कॉन्टेंट एवरी सैटरडे एट नाइन पी एम सो स्टे ट्यून्ड सो टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्पीक अबाउट अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन दैट इज आज इन इंटरव्यू ऑल द इंटरव्यूज वेदर इट इज टेक्निकल इंटरव्यू नॉन टेक्निकल इंटरव्यू इट इज आज टेल मी अबाउट योर सेल्फ सो आई एम गोइंग टू रिवील अ लॉट ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू अ लॉट ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट टेल मी अबाउट योर सेल्फ सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड Okay, the very important question. Tell me about yourself. So I'll break the video uh, in two different points. What are the do's and what are the don'ts? And I'll also speak about freshers, how they should approach, and what experienced people, all the experienced people, how they should approach answering this question. So the first one, I'll go first with don'ts, and then I'll touch up on all the do's that you should do. Okay, the so first one, uh, don'ts are uh, basically uh, do not tell your marks. Do not you don't have to tell your marks or college until unless you are from uh, IIT and IIT and you no know, uh, top college. If you are from the top notch college, then that is okay. To speak about your college, and as a fresher, obviously you have to tell your college name. You have to tell your grades. But if you are experienced, so uh, you don't have to take your college name. You don't have to talk about your grades. Until unless that is very uh, good, so and don't talk about your caste, religion, or your family background. All that you don't have to talk about because you don't. You are not going there to take sympathy. Okay, you are going there as a technical engineer or you no know, whatever the role is. So you are going there to work. You don't want the sympathy. You don't want. You are not begging for the job. You are applying there and you are an employee going to work there. Okay, and don't talk about your parents until unless they ask you. uh here and there little bit you can talk but at least in the tell me about yourself you don't have to talk about your parents you don't have to talk about your siblings or any of your personal life okay and in case uh, um uh anything anything which is not relevant that can that doesn't give any information about your technological knowledge about your skill set then please don't say that okay don't use any negative tone any negative words and don't talk about uh, any negative about that specific company which you have applied for or the previous companies that you've worked on never do that and don't talk about your managers their goods bads whatever i mean if little bit here and there is okay but still you don't have to talk at least tell me about yourself why because tell me about yourself is a uh, uh, hard to hard maybe 1 to 1 and a half minutes or max max 2 minutes of uh, you know talk that you are going to say about or oh, tell me about yourself you'll hardly going to speak about 80 to 90 seconds so in that what all can you talk so mostly focus on yourself your skill set and your knowledge so coming on to the do's part so this also i'll break down into what freshers and uh, experienced people have to do so mostly i'll first start with the experience and then uh, keep adding points for freshers so the do's are uh, very important you talk about how many years of experience do you have which all projects you have worked on what are the different technology stacks you have worked on okay especially the project you mentioned the project which you have learned a lot from that particular project you have to mention first i mean it doesn't matter you have to go in sequence it is not there is no hard and fast rule saying that you have to go in sequence with i will talk about the latest project first no talk about the project which you have worked a lot and then little bit the current project you can say but if you have spent a lot of time in particular project and you have learned a lot on that project so speak about that project first then speak about your roles and responsibility that you have done because if you have uh, worked as a developer then speak about those things that you have done you have designed something you have worked with you no know, client uh, got the information requirement gathering you have done and planning you have done and if you are a lead you would have taken responsibility of a different um, no all the teammates their responsibility assigning the task you no know, taking different uh, knowledge sessions you know, we call it as kt knowledge transfer sessions and uh, maybe any other any other responsibility that you would have taken and uh, talk specially please talk about your technology stacks all the technology kal tools that you have worked on okay if it is java speak about that particular java go in little detail saying that i have worked on classes and these framework that framework and if you have worked as a tester so go in detail saying that what kind of testing you have done what all tools you have worked on what all different type of testing you have done regression unit or whatever 
go in little detail you don't just no on uh, just don't speak on the creamer creamer go little detail about what all technology you have worked on to what level of the knowledge or skill set you have for how many years you have worked so go little detail okay and a very important point it may not be very big but do speak about little of your challenges that you have faced in the particular responsibility but but make sure that challenge is very positive and gives a very positive impact saying that you are particularly a leader a person who can take the responsibility take charge and then solve that particular problem okay and uh, for uh, freshers i will speak uh, some more points that you can add uh, you can speak about your college you can speak about your grades i mean if you should have good grades obviously if you, if you want to speak about grades then um, uh, uh, what all uh, internships you have done what all different projects you have done i might be self project or maybe you would have gone to any institute or you would have gone taken into any internship so speak about that project speak about the technology stacks again i'll tell you to speak all the technology that you have worked on and uh, so uh, also um, uh, all different technologies you have worked on so maybe you would have worked on big data you would have on etl or maybe you would have worked on uh, manual or um, you know java development or python development or scripting or whatever so make sure you uh, specifically mention that and make sure that is in connection in line with the uh, with the role that you are applying for suppose you have applied for a manual testing role and you are talking about automation or you may be talking about uh, development so that doesn't go hand in hand so make sure you talk about those technologies talk about those fields those frameworks or uh, those tools which the for a particular role you have applied for you are applying for the interview so make sure that is in line with that okay uh, and any kind of boot camp Uh, for freshers any kind of boot, boot camp workshops that you have attended you no know, all that any kind of presentations or you know uh, demonstrations you have done all that you mention make sure you mention that okay because you don't have much to speak experienced people have lot of projects that they can speak about but freshers you don't have so make sure you uh, speak on those these topics okay and uh, make sure uh, make it uh, small crispy and uh, to the point don't drag it to make sure you practice a lot about tell me about yourself this is very generic what i'm talking about make sure you practice a lot because this is one of the question that you are sure sure that this question is going to be asked and this question is asked so you have to answer and uh, this is the easiest way that you can answer a question because in an interview you don't know which all questions will be asked but you know that this question will be asked so make sure you prepare to the best of your capacity and uh, Uh, no present it to the best of your uh, skill set okay uh, and uh, thank you for watching see you next week uh, saturday 9 pm so make sure you like uh, share and subscribe uh, to this video if you have got any knowledge and if it is helping you so make sure you share it with your friends so that it helps them to prepare for uh, this particular question and about yourself okay thank you and see you next week bye bye